Hey, what's up, uh, YouTube and Facebook Nation? This is your old pal, Kevin, Captain Milo Man Nelson, coming at you with a, another episode of Toy Talk. And in this episode, I'm going to be going over or reviewing the uh, Force Hasbro Force Link Ray action figure from Star Wars Episode Eight. The Last Jedi and as you can see the packaging layout is similar to that of the Force Link Jedi Master Luke Skywalker with the exception of the image of Rey up in the corner and so forth and on the you know Force Link, like I've said in the previous episode with the review of the Luke figure, the uh, Force Link device is required to, it's required to be able to use for, the, you know, with the figure to, for like sounds and so forth. I've yet to pick up the device itself, I will eventually and on the back there's the device and the ray figure and all sorts of different text in different languages the Star Wars logo of course the a lot of the text is kinda hard to see here and anyway I'll be I'll be back in a bit open open ray up open the figure up and get her out of the packaging take a look at the figure itself okay here's the uh, Ray figure out of her packaging and take a look at the articulation her arm articulated at the uh, shoulders the head and the legs standard five points of articulation similar to the uh, Luke figure the Jedi Master Luke figure also similar articulation as the original 1970s and 80s Star Wars figures you get a shot of the head sculpt it's probably a little fuzzy but looks like a fairly decent head sculpt for a figure of this scale and the outfit her outfit like a soft plastic and her weapons accessories we have a little blaster Let's see if I can put it in her hand here. Oops. Oops. Might not fit in that hand very well. I'll try the other hand. Okay, it's the first time I've opened this figure. I bought it, I bought the figure yesterday. She kind of holds her blaster. It's a little loose fitting. Luckily she's got the holster, functional holster. Slide that, slide the blaster in her holster. Oops, not quite in there. I believe it's a functional holster. I'll have to figure out that later. And another kind of a staff looking weapon that she had at the end of at the end of Force Awakens. And of course, 
her lightsaber, which of course was Luke's original saber from A New Hope. See if I can get that in her hand. Kind of tricky here. Kind of tricky, some of these things. I'll try to get that in later. Other than the difficulty of her holding her weapons, it's not a bad little action figure. Like I said, I'll work on getting her to hold those weapons at a later time. Anyway, that's the uh, three and three quarter scale Hasbro Force Link Ray figure. And that'll be it for this review. Till next time, be good. If you can't be good, then be careful, or at least be good at it. Later. Okay, I'm actually back with a quick follow-up. And here's Ray standing up on her own. If I manage to get the gun into the holster and the lightsaber into her hand and the staff looking weapon on her slung over her shoulder so this concludes this episode of toy talk anyway later <laughs>